Hey guys, um, just wanted to come on um, for two reasons. Um, I It's a new day and I'm feeling, Albert's asleep, I'm feeling like I fancy making video and everything that I want to film today is kind of already out so I figured I'd just kind of do it. Um, but I wanted to um, to say thank you profusely for, for for everyone's comments. I'm gradually making my way through all the comments and replying but it means so much to me, to, to Chris as well, it means a lot. Um, it, clearly I'm not alone and, and it makes me feel like less lonely really because it, it feels lonely at the moment I think and everything feels very overwhelming. Um, yesterday after I stopped filming it took me an hour just to get downstairs to, to just get the momentum to get downstairs um, and I'd look around and if things would be all over the floor and it, I couldn't bring myself to tidying them up because it was all too much it was just really strange um, a few people have mentioned that it might be postnatal depression I don't think it is just because it's not re um, the, the children are what bring me the, the only joy at the moment um, it, it doesn't seem linked to them it's more kind of external factors and uh, I've spoken to Chris and we may just stay where we are, but he's given me the blessing to, if I see another property that's bigger, to actually go ahead and rent it. Um, if it makes me feel better for the, you know, because it, it'd be minimum six months tenancy and, and we're not going to be buying anything within the next six months. And if we do, it's not going to, you know, it'll take a long time to kind of get everything processed. So, um, and of course he is looking for a new job and I think I'd rather he found that first or, or you know, I don't know, we'll, we'll see how it pans out. But um I, i'm not going to rush to move if if I, if we do we do if we don't we don't just see what's available and you know i'll kind of leave it up to fate really um so yeah but obviously the thing with the dog is still really upsetting and um it was nice chris and i had a really sort of like nice afternoon after he'd finished work and he was feeling better so we just kind of enjoyed each other's company and just talked it through and he, he's really supportive um, there's quite a few other videos that like a bit more in depth and deeper that I wanted to film. I might do Albert's four month update depending on how this goes and if he wakes up. He's been I've been out today shopping. I wanted to do a haul today because I have been I have purchased quite a lot of stuff and some of it's really lovely and I really wanted to show you kind of like our style and what we like, um, particularly for the children. So I'll go ahead and show you now. Okay, so for Sebastian, um, he's a really awkward size. So lengthwise, he is size two to three years in length. Um, of course, he turns three, so even then, these are still a little bit long, but they fit him in length. In waist, they don't fit him at all. He really needs sort of one to two year old clothes for his waist. But these jeans from Primark are really nice. I love the kind of denim. It's like a soft wash denim. And it's got these elastic bits so that you can tie the waist. And his is like at the maximum tightness. and. Uh, they finally fit him so we've been buying him some of those we've got two pairs of those also these from Primark as well they've got this kind of fluorescent kind of lightning bolt I'm not sure about the shape of these and again these are 80 24 to so um 24 to 36 months I think but still the waist is still might be a bit because he is so skinny so um so I got those and then to go with those I bought a t-shirt this is like £1.50 or something it's just a nice fluorescent t-shirt he's had quite a few fluorescent t-shirts over the past and I really like those for him and these joggers from Primark classic staple I think they're like £4 for the pair I can't remember Sebastian's had these same joggers every time he grows out of them since he was about I don't know one maybe he's had like the tiny ones and they're just so soft and so good and they're really good for nursery but I do think people are wondering like are you ever going to buy many other joggers but I really like them and he likes them they're just great for nursery because they're cheap and it doesn't matter if they get dirty and then I got him this kind of t-shirt and it says I'm a troublemaker but I get away with it he doesn't get away with it um I've also been buying him because of course he's potty trained now I've been buying him lots of pants and he's really into like Star Wars and also Marvel as well um it, if he had the choice he'd probably go for frozen pants but we just got star wars ones and we've got um a pack of these and it's got all the different star wars characters and again he's two to three years i think for these um because he has got like a tiny little bottom he's so skinny 
and again some more of these kind of chino pants we've got some beige ones which um some new beige ones which are in the wash and then these kind of like blue which i really like um and again we've got this tightening issue situation here but <coughs> oh excuse me nevertheless they fit okay so for albert okay so i don't think i've shown you these and these are second hand i don't tend to buy this is by frugi i don't tend to buy frugi new unless it's in the sale because frugi is very expensive um and the, uh, well if it was sebastian i would have probably bought it new but with albert he's growing really fast so he yeah i need to buy clothes for him quite regularly so but i absolutely love these dungarees they're like my favorite so i've got um these little tractor ones i've got um these little whale ones and i've got this one's got like monkey and zoo animals on it and then i got the vests as well to go with those um that you know it kind of came with the seller was selling the vest too for our holiday this summer this is actually six to nine months um these this which is so cute and it's by a brand called duns i really like kind of like swedish scandinavian type prints bright prints i'm really not into like blue like i used to really like going to like asda and tesco's because for a while they had some bright stuff but um they've stopped that now and it's kind of just like blues and jeans and just really bought like no offense to anyone who but you know what i mean i like bright colors i'm all about bright colors um so yeah i got this and i thought it was going to be really nice for a holiday it's looking at it is quite big i'm hoping it i'm sure it'll fit him fine but um i mean our holiday's not till may so he's got time to fit in it and then i got this as well which i think this is, is this this isn't frugi oh this is maximora so this is another really nice scandinavian brand again very expensive and the website i'll leave the link down below it's ellison wren it's actually shop local to well not local to me but it's not far from me um but they do do sell online as well and they had a sale on and i got this a romper and i like it because it's really stretchy um what size is this i think this is also six oh albert's awake <laughs> albertina lorino is awake Abertoni Laroni. He's really going to be miserable because he's been asleep for a long time. So I am just going to feed him. So I think this is six to nine months. Oh, it's size 68. So that's like six months. It's pretty stretchy though. It's like almost like lycra. Okay, so um, Albert's just feeding. I'm going to try to do this with one hand if it's possible. Um, Maximora trousers. Got some of these. These are three to six months. So they look really long. Um, he's got tiny legs. So he's still in 0 to 3 in his legs and i think he'll be naught to three for a little while longer yet but his body's three to six months um we have got some naught to three kind of like body suits but i've had today to go out and buy some three to six months like pajama you know baby grows um and i only bought a few because it's just purely for bedtime that he tends to wear them apart from the kind of funky prints um and i got this from mother care it's a neutral um and again that one um, and I did buy these with the intention to potentially, you know, if we ever did have another baby, where's the other one? It's got like, I really like these. Um, it's got like little squirrels from m and I really like m and clothing. I've not, oh, now he's calling me. Okay, so the next thing I got, um, are these from Jules. You might remember Sebastian used to wear a lot of these tights, but I've got some of these from Jules. And we also have some blaze and rose ones as well. And I really like these. Again, they're just really comfortable. I, I'm all about comfort. One thing we don't tend to have is jeans, just because I found that Sebastian, I hate jeans. So I found that Sebastian, like as a baby, just looked really uncomfortable with jeans. And particularly Albert's got really chunky legs. So they just look like they would be really uncomfortable. So I've never kind of gone for them. Oh, Albert's just like really tired bless him um some of these they're like the little wide pants really good go over cloth nappies and these are from Sainsbury's and I got those in three to six months and you guys might remember I don't know if I showed you these the ones with monsters on maybe I have maybe I haven't but anyway I got these these are not to three but I also bought three to six months and they are also from Sainsbury's Albert trumping also from Sainsbury's um but they don't stock them anymore however if you do like these, M&S have some that are quite similar. Right, I've put Albert in his little bouncer. Hopefully he'll stay there for like the next five minutes. I also got this. This is um, three to six months, but it does kind of wash quite small. I'm always having to like stretch it. 
this is from Little Bird at Mother Care and I bought the next size up as well because um, I just really like it. I have got another one that they stock. It's got like numbers all over it and it's kind of like a red colour. Um, but I've packed that away because that's that's one that he had when he was teeny tiny. You might see it on Instagram. Um, and I bought it again for six to nine months. So I really, really like these from Little from Little Bird in the post. Something else came in the post as well. Let's see what this is. Oh, I bought this on eBay. This is from Next and I just liked it. So I got that. Nothing special, just a baby grow that's three to six months for, for hour. But I just really like that. I like, again, like I said, I'm, I'm a big fan of the kind of like bright colours. I'm all about that. So for myself, I'm sorry, Albert. For myself, um, I've bought a few tops recently. I just thought I'd show them. They're nothing to like write home about, but they're just breastfeeding tops. That's I say breastfeeding tops, just tops that I can easily breastfeeding that are quite light, that are kind of easy for summer. So I just got this today and this is from Primark. I really like this kind of detailing on the sleeve. Um, I really like that so I got that and again as you guys know I've said before I always do one up one down so these kind of work really well I've got this as well from Primark and it's got like this thing at the back I had to cut the label out because it's scratchy um, but I really like that and these are all good for like spring as well I think so we went to Liverpool recently and I didn't realize but Liverpool have a forever 21 and I love it in there I really love it in there. So I got this top for £1.50 in the sale and it's got a mark on it, I think. Can't seem to come off. I think it's like something oily, so that's never good. And then I got that as well. I think that was a similar sort of price. Quite a nice light, light t-shirt. And then I got this from Etsy by a, sh a, a girl called Lauren Dyer Fashion. And I think she just designed the t-shirt and I love it. And it just says, messy hair sleep deprived i need caffeine to survive and i love that um t-shirt i really really like it i'm trying to think if there's anything else but there's nothing else that i can think of so i hope you like this video i just wanted to do something lighthearted while i had all the washing out and uh, it i think just doing something now kind of gets me in the swing a bit look a little hard but just sitting there thank you again so much for your message and um for your messages and i'll see you guys soon bye